I'm Tom. I'm from Robbie Rotors, Brushless Motor, Outrunner, Slot Car Motor Shop. I'm going to show you today how to push a shaft out of an Outrunner motor so you can change it into a slot car motor. These are some of the different length shafts that come out of the different size motors that we use in slot cars. As you can see, they all pretty much have that shoulder on them though. So be careful when you're driving out these shafts out of the rotors because you could damage your rotor hub. I drive them from the bottom to the top. That avoids driving the shoulder through the hub. Take your motor. As you can see, the shaft comes out the top. We want it to come out the bottom of the motor. So once you remove the C-clip from the end of the shaft on the motor, you will be able to take and separate the rotor from the stators as seen here. Now we have to get the shaft out of the motor. I take a quarter inch socket, place it on top of the motor bell, put it in my little pin vise here, center it up, and then screw it in and push it out this way. After that happens, and you can pull the shaft out. Sometimes you have to drive it out a little bit. There is a hub inside of this, so be careful. There's also a bump, if you will, on top of this shaft. You cannot drive this shaft through the motor this way. With this shoulder on it, it will ruin the hub inside. Once you've done that, you take some Permatex, the green Permatex thread locker. So put thread locker on the end of your new two millimeter shaft. And that will be pushed back into here. So put the thread locker on the end of the shaft very sparingly, and then take your shaft, turn it upside down, and I start I turn the end ball upside down and I start the shaft inside of the hub with my fingers. Then you can turn that and place it inside your press again and slowly turn it back in. And once you can make contact, then you just push this in with your, with your vise until the shaft comes out flush at the top. So when you reassemble the motor, now the shaft comes out the bottom side of it and you can put a gear on it. Hope this helps.